YouTube, what's good? Yo, Bobby TV in the building, man, live from New York. This video is about the one and a half blade. That nice length, that dark Caesar blade. That's what I've been telling everybody about my channel for a long time. As you can see, this blade cuts my man Kev's hair down real nice and neat. Lays it real tight, it's a ceramic one and a half blade. He has a swirl right in the front of his hair, so you're gonna see me freehanding around his hair to even that out. So when he go home and brush his hair, the hair's even, somewhat even. Sometimes you can't get that perfectly even, but um, you know, it lays down right and doesn't hang over the hairline and affect the way the sharp line looks. So I kind of like taper out around the hairline, just in general, the front, the side, and the back, so that there's no bulk. And because usually when you go with the grain, there's a little bulk on the edges of the hairline. So you get that off so your line lays tight and neat. A lot of barbers don't do that for some odd reason, but I like my cut to have a particular look. Like when people hop out my chair, they need to have that yo Bobby look, you know what I mean? So it's my signature, it's my business card, my walking business card. So I lay down his beard with the same height, one and a half. I use the one A for the mustache. But I like to call a cut like this, the classic man's dark Caesar. Everything even, the beard not too light, not too dark. And whenever I do my beards, I start from underneath the neck because it allows me to even out both sides. You know, when underneath the neck is done, when I do the left and then go to the right, it's easier to match it up. Well, for me it is. Actually, one of my clients taught me that years ago that does his own beard. So. As you can see what this one and a half does, makes the cut look real neat. Nice round back to go with it. Out here in New York, it's either a round back or a tapered out back, you know. But he looks like he has a do-rag on his head from that one and a half, man. It helps too with the grain of his hair, but those with the one and a half blade just leaves like such a neat trim. I don't usually use plastic guards to do like scissors. I always go with the ceramic blades and um, a nice little razor finish. Keep him tight for his chicks, his side chicks, his wife, whoever he dealing with. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, I'm just playing with you. I ain't gonna get you in trouble, my brother. But a nice crisp razor line underneath there. A nice little trim, get the loose hairs up. And here you have it, a classic cut with the one and a half blade by Yo Bobby TV. Please do hit that subscribe button. Those are my bevel blades, man. It wasn't charged up for this video. I wanted to use it, but I forgot to charge it, man. But um, I rather cordless clippers. I love my bevels. And um, big shout to the Bevel fam. And need to get a classic cut and you want to look good for your work, meet. Holla at me, man. Yo, Bobby TV. So hit that subscribe button for more videos to come. Stay tuned, y'all. Uh. Big shout to Baby Grand.